him even if you are even if you are big you are you are thick you are slim no matter your size people will have something to say about you wasting time wake up wake up wake up wake up wake up i was really really sick during wasi and i couldn't even write my math paper hi guys welcome to my first ever youtube channel my name is denise Aikwe. i'm 22 years old i am still attending Ligon. and you know you will learn more about me as time goes on this is my first youtube video i decided to start this youtube channel i'm personally this youtube channel has been long overdue i've had friends family you know even strangers advised me to start a youtube channel well with regards to my singing they, they wanted me to start a youtube channel to be posting singing videos and all that but uh, <sighs> well we'll get to the reason why i haven't started yet but then before i proceed i just wanted to encourage you all that if there's anything you want to do anything positive and legal underlined you want to do please just go ahead and do it just go ahead and do it what are you waiting for look i know there are so many people out there who are discouraged like you want to do something but then you are scared of what people will say about you their reaction towards it what they might think all those all you are battling with self-esteem it could be anything at all and i'm telling you that if you are if you are scared of what people will say what people will think or whatever just think about it this way you don't know them they don't know you even if they do so what you might be you, you <laughs> look you might do something and they might even want to do it but then you are like you are taking the initiative do you get me like you're taking the initiative start something don't waste your time time is always there but then if you are wasting time you are wasting your time because after all you don't know where you're going to die and that takes me back to the point of not caring what people will say because <laughs> you will die they will die eventually and everything is going to be forgotten but then do you want to die not leaving a mark do you want to die not leaving a legacy something to positively impact society or something that people remember you for i just want to tell you today to just go for it honestly just go for it so um the reason why i let me just let me just make this a quick story time the reason why i haven't started or i didn't start this youtube channel earlier um is because this goes way back to senior high school during the wasi time i was really really sick during wasi and i couldn't even write my math paper i mean i was in the exam hall but i couldn't even lift my head to write the paper at all i didn't put anything down so i was even surprised that i had a mark like i i even i didn't even get f i was surprised but i still failed so i had to stay one whole year to rewrite it um and that's why i'm still in the university i'm now in my final year i, I would have been done um i would have been done this year but i'll be i'll be done next year so, uh, so well um <laughs> so during the wasi i even had this friend christopher butchie if you are watching this i'm so grateful for you i i don't stop talking about this because not everyone will do that for you so during the time i was sick i couldn't walk like, it was so painful that i couldn't even stand so my friend Christabel literally carried me to the bathroom and took my bathroom like she bathed me and i really really appreciate her for that and that should tell you how bad this illness was so now i don't know what it was i don't know what kind of sickness that was but then i don't wish that on anyone not even my enemies so yes um so after that i just lost so much weight i became so skinny I don't know uh, probably I was, i'll insert a video or a picture or something of how i used to look so yeah this is how i looked before i was so 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 slim and now my belly is as big as a drum now people are talking about how big my belly is and that's why i say don't care what people say because 
whether you're big or small, they'll still have something to say about you. So yeah, I was so slim before and now I've gained a bit of weight. <laughs> but thank God. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah, because of that, people were body shaming me. <sighs> God, you have no idea. Those of you who get body shamed, even if you are, even if you are big, you are, you are thick, you are slim. No matter your size, people will have something to say about you. People will have something to say about you because everyone has their preferences. So yeah, I even had people tell me that aren't I shy working with my friends because, I, like, I look out of place and they are missed. How do you expect me to feel if, when I hear something like that? Do you hear me? All these things. Added up. I don't even want to talk about all the negative comments I had because of my weight. Because I was so desperate to gain weight. I was so, so, so desperate to gain weight that I didn't even want to be seen outside. I wouldn't go out. I don't even want to be seen in videos. Like, if we, even if I go out, like, don't take a video of me. Don't, I don't want to be seen. I don't want to be seen anywhere. You give, I was shy to, I am still shy to take pictures. I don't take pictures. Um, <laughs> so many things. So yeah, these are these are some of the things that made me lose confidence because I was I was such a confident person. I I always had a positive mindset that I when I put my mind to anything, I'll be able to do it. But because of these things, I just lost all the confidence. I don't even know why I let them get to me so much. It was a lot. Like it was even coming from family, friends, everywhere, even strangers when they see me. Or maybe when if someone hasn't seen me in a while and the person sees me like hey Denise auntie uh won't hear a crap like those things <laughs> and me personally uh I don't know if I should be sharing this but then if you want to get to me you can get to me emotionally but then not physically because I'm my my pain tolerance is high so even when back in school if you lash me I will not cry <laughs> but then when you say something to hurt me I'll definitely cry so yes all these things all these things all these things led to me not having the confidence to start this youtube channel i was always making excuses my daughter would tell me that hey, when are you going to start i'll make excuses on my phone well i, I used to have a 7 um, and 8 plus and the memory was small the camera quality wasn't all that and that takes me to my next point um if there's something you want to do Please don't wait for the right time. Don't wait for the right time. Like, make do with what you have. With the little you have, just start with it. Do you get me? Start with it, and it will definitely yield results in the end. Just little by little, gradually, gradually. Right? Maybe you are waiting for you. You are waiting to have everything. Let's say you want to be a nail tech or um, a lash tech. You want to wait till you have all the equipments before you start your business. If you have, you know, some lash strips, glue, this, that, this, just start little by little, little by little, little by little. It will definitely leave your results in the end. So don't wait till you have everything before you start something. And that's what I did. I just wanted everything to be in place before I started this. And I realized that, look, Denise, you are wasting time. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. Wake up. So yeah, that was... Uh, my my i spoke to my auntie about this auntie gifty i love you <laughs> i spoke to my auntie i spoke to my parents um matilda uh, my boyfriend even my siblings they all encouraged me people that i don't even know they all encouraged me to do this and i'm grateful i'm grateful for all of you I'm grateful for all of you for giving me the confidence to be able to start this journey and i hope that uh, I'm going to be, you know, consistent. So let me, yeah, I'm going to be consistent because back then, when I start doing something and I feel like it's not going the way I wanted to, I just stop. <laughs> I just stop. But then, I think I see some improvement. I used to procrastinate a lot, but then there's still it's still over there. But there baby steps, baby steps. I'm, 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 I'm I, 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 I can see huge improvement. So I just want you to use me as an example. <laughs> what if I've started this? Trust me, you can start it because I didn't even know that I'll be sitting, that I'll be sitting here in front of a camera doing this. Well, I'm using my phone, so uh, I didn't know I'll be sitting over here doing this because I was always making excuses. I was always always making excuses. So this this introduction is just to encourage you to go for what you want. 
to go for what you want. Don't don't listen to anyone. They are going to die. You are going to die. Everybody will forget everybody. Like <laughs> just just do it. Just do. Don't care. Don't care about anybody. And as long as you know that you are doing the right thing. I'm not going to encourage you to do anything illegal or anything negative. As long as you know you're going to do you are doing the right thing, just go for it. So um basically this channel is going to be about almost everything. Almost everything. Um, I'm going to be posting singing videos. I'll even appreciate if you can comment down some songs you'd like me to do videos on. Um yeah, like request some songs. Um if you want me to do any video with anyone you can just comment yes um so yeah this video is going to be about um, i don't have any particular thing i'm going to do I'm, I'm going to i don't have any particular thing i'm going to be doing on this video i i, I just want that diversity you get me so yes uh, yeah that's basically it I hope you guys enjoy the subsequent videos I'm going to be posting. Um, I hope you guys subscribe, share, like, comment, everything just to support this journey I'm on. And this is for anyone who is battling with self-esteem. Just look at me and know that you can do this. If Denise has been able to do this, you can do this. Just get up and do whatever you want to do as long as you know that it's right. Don't look at what anybody is doing. Don't look at what anyone is saying. Don't compare yourself to anyone. If your friends are ahead of you, it means it's not your time. If your friends are ahead of you, it means it's not your time. Your time will definitely come. I was doing God when, God when, God when. And now gradually, I'm experiencing all the things that I've always wanted to experience. Yes. I'm experiencing all the things that I... No, I'm, I'm not there yet at all. I'm not where I want to be at all. But then it's a gradual process. And I can see that there's a lot of improvement in my life. So manifestation, just believe in yourself, do what you have to do, don't look at anyone. So yeah. <sighs> Once again, just join me on this journey. Let's do this together as a family. So you can call me D. I love you guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Mwah.